I love the shape of your mouth. I love the taste of your lips. I love the way you pull me into you and I melt when you're holding my hips. I love the scar on your chest and all your perfect tattoos. You're Kind of drug, the kind that I need, the only kind I could choose. We can't get any better than this. You've stolen me with your perfect kiss, and I know, I know, I know you have waited for. I love the sound of your laugh. Throw back your head. I love the way you always reach for my hand when I get out of bed. I love the way that you taste. Call me ball and chain. But you would sink to the depths of the sea, still breathing my name. shown me more love than I've ever known. I often think back uh, to when I had thought I sent to you my last text message, back when we were just trying things out. <laughs> I said to myself, if she doesn't respond, that's not that big of a deal. How can I expect a relationship to start after just meeting her one time? So when you didn't respond, I was disappointed. <laughs> um... <laughs> Luckily, three months later, I had an excuse to text you again, and happily, you responded. So here we are, we're making it official, we get some sweet jewelry out of the gig, <laughs> and I couldn't be more excited to start this journey with you. They say the first step is the most important step. I'd argue the most important step is the next one. Today is the first step in a lifelong journey, but it only ends when we stop moving forward. Sean. When I met you, I was immediately taken by your goodness, the positivity behind all of your intentions and your helpful nature. I thought it was so cute how when you first came to my apartment, you insisted on fixing the sliding doors and changing my license plates on my car for me because you said a lot of people hate doing that stuff and I don't mind it, so why not? I remember you promising me that when I was around you, you would strive to make it the most fun I'd ever had. Just so you know, you achieved that. I have videos upon videos of us 
being weirdos together or you making up your own lyrics to songs. And I feel so lucky and so excited to be a part of that. I once read a quote that said, one day someone will hug you so tight all of your broken pieces come back together. And that's exactly what you do for me. I love your laugh. I love your smile. I love your caring nature. I love the face you make when you think something's really cute. I really love the way you ask me, where are you going when I just get off the couch for water? <laughs> I promise to support you, to honor you, to love you unconditionally, including all of those crazy hypothetical things you keep asking me. <laughs> yes, if you grew wings, I'd still love you. <laughs> I promise to never stop singing our silly songs or dancing whenever the mood strikes. I will always let you into what I'm thinking and feeling. I promise to never stop aiming for better. I'll never keep secrets from you. I'll always, oh, I did it. I'll always confide in you. <laughs> You inspire me every day to be the best man that I can be. I can't imagine where I'd be without you, and I can't wait to see where this journey takes us. I love you. My vow is to continue to strengthen our foundation, to choose you every day, and to work to provide you with the security you so beautifully provide for me. I promise to listen to you and to always try my best to truly hear and understand you and work to you when I don't. I vow to never give up cuddles and car hand holding and to work to show you how much I love you every single day. I vow to remind you how good you are at your core and how positive your intentions are. I vow to encourage you in all you do and to support you fully. I promise to only make a couple of comments a year about how fantasy football is your girlfriend <laughs> and to try to not interrupt you when you're super into one of your video games. I vow to keep our family culture one of laughter and embracing our weirdness. And of course, I vow to love you unconditionally forever. By the great power vested in me, by the state of Oregon, I pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to present to you for the very first time the newlyweds Haley and Sean. Till the sun rises, I want to stay with you and never leave. The world's slowing down, my heart's speeding up. I know I might seem crazy. I look into your eyes, lighting up the night when you are with me. Love is in the air.
Love is in the air.